From Klein Spitzkoppe in Namibia, a topaz crystal floater it appears, doubly terminated. We're first going to go around this termination, have a look across there, and see the form of the topaz going across. So, whereas with quartz you'd have the Lemurians running lengthwise, here you have them running um, uh, sideways. Well, let's go through here. Little internal uh, vugs. Uh, uh, I've actually found in the past, I've actually found a little gas come water bubble trapped in a topaz from Spitzkopper. So we're going to have a look. It's a, it's a wild chance, but who knows. And what I'm going to do is with strong lighting from behind, I'll move the specimen from side to side under magnification, of course. And we'll look for motion. Then when we turn it over, we have the, the other crystal face of the specimen. Very, very odd shaped topaz, floater, lovely, lovely little guy. Very, very bright, uh, vibrant, maybe a slight shade of blue. Uh, uh, often we find the blue topaz and of course the silver topaz uh, from this deposit. All the way from uh, Namibia, um, Klein Spitzkopper, a famous locality for some lovely topazes.